All right, guys, me and Virgil are trying a new lake that we found on Fish Brain. We think it's public, but we're not sure. And I just caught a big picker on the f uh, second cast. It's very shallow, but we think this comes, these fish come from the river, which is right across the road. During severe floods, they get trapped in here. He's about 18 inches. All right, Virgil's on one. Oh man, that was close. Virgil man. got a large mouth and I got a pet girl. It almost got me in the face. Not bad, guys. Check it out, man. Guys, we both caught fish Doubles. in the first minute. <laughs> Not bad. blood all over my hand. I can't believe it actually worked, man. I didn't expect it to be this many people driving back and forth, though. Yeah. Makes me weary. Yeah, that would be tough. All right, guys, a little large mouth. That's three fish though, and we're on the bad side of the lake. We're on the side with no cover and it's shallower. Guarantee if I was on that other side, I'd be hammering them right now. A lot of trees over there and it's a couple feet deeper. Oh my God, no way, dude. Oh my God. Yes. I like this place now, three kinds. I did not expect to get this in here, man. Guys, this crappie's probably 12 inches on a three inch swim bait at that. They're biting good today. That's what I kept missing, man. Guys, this is one of my new favorite lures is this Largo Shad. I just absolutely love it. That is not a bad crappie for a little pond like this. Oh my God, this place must not get fished that much, man. Because this would not be in here that big. Guys, not a bad crappie for a little one acre lake. I am impressed. Well venture. Holy cow, man. Yeah, I'm coming back. That just sold me right there. It's not a bad crappie. <sighs> huh. That's, I cannot believe that. I honestly can't. Well, now I wish I would have brought crappie jigs. <laughs> All I brought is, yeah, actually, I got two-inch grubs. I'd probably get more bites on, than, on, than on this thing. Holy cow, man. Did you expect that? Big bass, bigger. They're not all small, man. They're not all small, guys. <sighs> He's at least a full pound, maybe even a pound and a half. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm using. It's a three inch Largo Shad, River Shiner is the color. 
and these are jig head swim baits that are a half an inch with a six size six hook on them. They're very big hooks. You don't miss the fish on them. These Largo shads are tough. Mini swim baits, they're ruined after one or two fish. I've done caught six or seven, eight fish on this thing because I caught fish on it the other day, two or three of them, and they just don't tear up. Eventually the paint falls off before the lure tears up. That is not a bad largemouth. You want to do me a favor real quick, Virgil? When you get that in. It's not bad. I'm real impressed now. You can tell the fish are biting good today or we wouldn't have caught this many. If it was bright and sunny and hot, we wouldn't have. About a pound and a third. 12 inches. Man. He didn't bite till five feet from the bank yeah. in a foot of water. All right, guys, Virgil's on a decent fish here. That's a nice one, yeah. That ain't bad. Not bad at all, man. That is not bad. It's about like the one I caught, I guess. They're not all pathetic in here. They're not bad at all, really. It's not that bad of a place so far. I'm impressed with it. More size of it yeah, <laughs> and you run around the canoe just dude, constantly probably moving probably around. There's probably a three or four in here at least. And find that deep and hold too, wherever that is. Yeah. Oh my God. I broke off, so I'm done. Yeah, that's the fish of the day. Well, not really. It's still, that was a good hit, though. All right, guys, this is our final fish. I think I'm done. I ain't got nothing tied on now, except a crankbait that's too deep. Guys, we did amazing. This place is either low pressured or it was the complete overcast that had them turned on. I don't think we would have done this good in the heat of the day. Yeah, well, it's barely showing up. We wouldn't have done this good in the heat of the day right. when it's 100 degrees, I guarantee you. Not a little place like this. Uh-uh. Man, I may come back. Not, I mean, maybe this weekend even. If I do, it has to be tomorrow, though. <laughs>